I'm Trey Watson with Lake Creek Farm and I thought I'd answer a common question that we get um, quite a bit is about what chill hours are. So we list on our website uh, the number of chill hours that each type of fruit tree would need and chill hours are just the number of hours below 45 degrees that a tree experiences in a given winter. Uh, some research says it's 32 to 45. I generally tend to be in the school of thought that it's any temperature below 45 degrees, including if it's 20 degrees. So where we live in East Texas in Nacogdoches County, it's generally about 600 chill hours on average. Well, any average is very, I guess never happens, right? So the average is just kind of the, with the middle. So oftentimes it's been less. And last winter we had um, 1,100 chill hours. So it's a big wide variation um, but basically you want to grow the tree the fruit tree that has the proper number of chill hours for your area if you're in michigan you probably don't want to grow a tree that has requires 200 chill hours most likely because it's going to bloom earlier um, if you're where i'm at you don't want to grow a macintosh apple because very rarely is it going to ever produce fruit the chill hours set the physiological triggers within the tree to produce blooms and fruit the following season. And so if a fruit tree does not get enough chill hours, it will not produce fruit. Um, likewise, if it has a low number of chill hours, generally it blooms early and in a lot of parts of the country, it's not going to produce. So that's just a quick rundown on chill hours and I am standing in front of a pretty peach tree. All right, have a good day.